boy made this Hey man, we hanging out in the ATL with my, this rapper here, man. Hey bro, tell, hey, what, what, what name you go by in the rap game, man? Yeah, man, I go by the name of the one, man. The one. Where you come up with the one from, bro? Actually, it's my birth name, you know. It's on my birth certificate, so you know that's my name, the one. D E R J U A N. All right, bro. How long you been in the game, man? Let me tell you, man. I've been in the game for eight years, man. So eight years you just been doing your own thing or you independent eight years. What, what what actually made you get started in this rap game? Man, just being at the house, you know what I'm saying? You can go check my album, Rap to Pay the Bills out, my let my album I just dropped. Um basically started in the hood, you know what I'm saying? Just in the house, just recording, like off an of MP3 player, you know, and it just Started from making big time investments in my music, you know what I'm saying? And we just came about. That's how it all came about. Uh, who are some of your influences, man? Some of the people that influence you in music? Well, I grew up listening to Gucci Man, Jeezy, you know, Future, you know, because I'm in Atlanta. So, and then I look up to Drake, because he a good artist, you know what I'm saying? He make good quality music. You know, you always can check him out. He be on all type of levels with his music. That's why I really like Drake out of all of them, though. You know what I'm saying? What, what influence Gucci Man has had on you? Because you know Gucci hot right now. I mean, that brother there. Man. And he, and he, see, he saw talent in so many artists. So what, 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 what strikes you about Gucci? Not just as an artist, but just an overall businessman. Man, I just like how he just go out there and he go hard, you know what I'm saying? Like, all his songs, really it's all about the the repeating. You, if you repeat what you're doing, just keep going, you know? I like how when I was young, I grew up listening to him and now I'm still the age I'm at now and he's still out there, you know what I'm saying? That's what I like, you know? Hey, so where can we find your music at? You can find me up on YouTube, iTunes, Google me, you can Google my name, The One. Let me show you something. At the one music. You can go on Twitter, type my name in. That's me. You know what I'm saying? You can catch me in the hood, you might catch me face to face, ask me for a CD, but you can go on iTunes and buy it, you feel me? Or you can go on that piff. Catch me on that piff. I'm always on that piff. You always on that piff. I'm always on that piff. Hey, so what, when, when you say a catalog, when artists talk about working and the hustle and the grind, how many songs would you say you got done right now? Man, you can go look me up on that piff. Like I'm telling you, I have about a whole bunch of mixtapes, a dozen of mixtapes, a dozen of you videos, you say a dozen. You, dozen of mixtapes, plenty of mixtapes. So you, 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 right now, if they came to you, you got enough music to just keep rolling. You could just, you can go through my music. If you can, I could die today, and I probably be okay with being. You, I have enough. I, you know what I'm saying? But I ain't gonna never stop. I'm gonna keep going. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna never stop. So. Y'all can go look me up, check me out. One know. particular artist in Atlanta, man, uh, Young Thug. Where he just seemed like he just came from nowhere, man, and just all of a sudden, like, boom. See, really, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I grew up in the same neighborhood. Actually, he's from where I'm from, but I'm kind of in the suburbs of Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? You know, but... I look up to everybody, anybody that say they do music, anybody that got something to offer in, in the industry, any, any way we can work, you know what I'm saying, I'm willing to do that. I'm, I'm supportive of any artist out there, you know, ain't no such thing as you can't do it, you can do it, just do it, you know, and I'm trying to make a positive influence on young kids, you know what I'm saying, and OGs as well, the older cats in the game too, you know what I'm saying, and that's about it, you know. We try. I'm trying to make history out here. You feel me? So that's about it. Where you see yourself in five years, man? Five years, I see myself probably better. I'm still gonna be doing the same thing. I ain't never gonna stop, but it's gonna be better. You know what I'm saying? To so improve, you're just crafting, man. Improve myself. You know, just keep going. That's all. All right, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it here once again. Where can we find you online, man? YouTube, Google. That Piff, iTunes, every store you can buy some music from. My name is Dirt One. Hey. Hey, bro. Um, tell me about this uh, artist, Deron, man. What, what's the, what's oh, the man. deal with, bro? Oh yeah, that's that's the new artist right there. That's the that's the future of, of Atlanta music right there. Uh, that's the one made this, man. Hey, 
he's the upcoming artist. Be on the lookout for him for real. Like he got so much music, so much projects. He got a lot of things going on, videos, shows. Yeah, he the future. I'm the first one to tell you. Yeah, Banks. Yeah. Yeah. How long you been knowing him, man? Uh, I had the pleasure of knowing the one for like three years. It'd be four years now. Yeah, I started. Uh, I worked beside him. Um, when you like, say work beside him, what you mean work beside yeah, him? Yeah, I, I was working um, at Chick Fil A with uh, the one when I saw him. I met through. I met him through his brother Desmond, and since then we just been cool. We clicked up, made music together. I fell in love with his passion for music. When you I mean? say passion, what do you mean? Work yeah, ethic? Yeah, man, his work ethic. He just. What can you say about his work ethic? Man, that's one of the hardest working person you will ever meet.